Now that we've added some effects to our audio, we can do the same with our video. Here in our video effects bin, I'm going to click on the drop down, and you can see you have tons of effects in here, but these aren't just special effects for fun and for the wow factor. These are some very necessary tools, and it's important to know that they are there. For example, under the adjust bin, you can see you have a lot of color controls, which can be a huge big deal when you're working with a video. So for example, you do have some lighting effects in here. Now we're going to use our farm scene as the example. So I click and drag and let go. Now looking at our program monitor, you can see I've added a little spotlight in one area. And if I scroll down, you can see it in my effects control. You can add different lights. You can add the color, the glow. You can change the type of light. We have a spotlight, but you can have it as a omni light, a directional light, getting everything. Go back to our spot, and you can change the location of that light. You can move it left or right or up or down so that you can really get specific on what it is you want to highlight. You can also change the radius and the angles and so forth. And you can also choose to remove it. Another important effect that you'll want to know is here, well, they're all rather important. You have color correction, for example, and here is your brightness and contrast control. If you come up with a video clip that's darker than you want, adding this one can make a huge big deal, helping you to adjust it and make corrections. You also have your color balance, ability to equalize, and so many other effects. You can add distortion effects. any number of different things. So for example, maybe I want to change the appearance of this. Maybe I want to make it look kind of like a watercolor painting. I'm going to add dust scratches and dust for this one. And you see, it made this look more like somebody painted it than an actual photo. Or I can remove it. So I always suggest taking some time to go through and check out these different effects that you have available. There's just so many things and just different items that you can use to really spruce up your project.